Okay, I'm going to adjust this and we should be good. Hello everybody, I'm streaming Uplink, which is a game I just started playing today. Um, but I have a decent understanding of it so far, but there's still a whole bunch of hurdles left for me to overcome. So I figure I decided to live stream and show everybody because this is a pretty cool game. Uh, <laughs> my username is Phil Vissin because they wanted me to put in Phil this in, so I decided to make myself Phil Vissin. I thought it was cute. Anyway, so um, I'm like. I'm just above intermediate, and I'm able to take level 5 missions now, and the concept of this game is that you play as a hacker, and you take on various hacking jobs, and you have to reroute your connections through a whole bunch of servers, and do a whole bunch of things like give somebody a degree in philosophy even though they didn't take the course, or delete their criminal record from the government database, or just delete the course be it espionage, and... I don't know, there's a whole bunch of different tasks to do, and I'll probably show you how to do them. Uh, so the text is tiny in this game, um, and I even have the resolution down a little bit so that the text would probably show up a little bit bigger, but uh, I'll read all the important information out just in case, because I know how hard it is to read some of this crappy text. Here is my very extensive list of servers that I can connect to. Um, if I want to take a mission, I first want to connect to the internal services system. And here I already have my username and password. This is like the only legitimate place where I enter my username and password because this is the hacker database. Um, I should probably say that you play this game as if it was a remote desktop installed that connects you to a given, uh, what do they call it, gateway that is your hacking machine. And so I'll take a look at the mission list, and I have a few that are available that I can actually take because of my um, level, but they're looking kind of tough. Um, I remember when I when I closed the game, I was looking at a bunch of these missions, and they're kind of tricky. Oh, hey, this one's only level four, um, so I could accept this one automatically, but I need to see what kind of countermeasures they have. It looks like they have... I ask, how secure is the target? And they respond, you will need to bypass the proxy server. So this isn't so bad. I have a proxy bypass. Um, I'm pretty far along uh, as far as things that I need to do, but I'm still at the basic level of proxy bypassing and firewall bypassing. And I know there's a whole lot more after that, um, but I'll show you what I have to do so far. So I've got my mission, and I believe I have enough equipment here if I take a look at my memory banks. These are the programs I have installed. Oh, I actually have some extra data here that I can get rid of. And it's a little bit unintuitive, but I have to access my file utilities file deleter and go over and delete this data. This was left over from some mission I used to have. Um, I'm looking to make money so I can upgrade my hardware so that I can have better specs which make things run faster and make it harder for me to get detected. And there's a bunch of other upgrades you can get like um, security cameras and tripwires and motion sensors that they install in the gateway room so that if the feds are trying to seize your computer it will notify you so you can try to do something about it. Although I guess without having some kind of de device to destroy your gateway computer it's kind of pointless. Um, so here is the list of my programs. I have a password breaker, a trace tracker, uh, which is version 2. If, um, I'll explain these actually. The password breaker is just a brute force password generation algorithm, which uh, will find passwords by essentially trying all the different combinations until it gets right. Uh, the trace tracker is that every time you break into a server, they will try to trace you back to your original gateway and um, the trace tracker tells you how far along the trace is. And version 2 gives you a percentage but not like in time remaining. So sometimes I get a little paranoid and I disconnect early because I don't want to get caught. Uh, the file copier is what it says. It copies files which you can use to get files off of servers and put it onto your uh, local hard drive and then send it to the client who usually wants the data stolen. Then there's also a file deleter which deletes files from servers, which sometimes you want to sabotage corporations for your employer. 
Then there is a log deleter, which is important when you are trying to cover your tracks. You log into one of the nodes that you used on the way to whatever system you're trying to use and delete the logs of um, the IP logs from when you accessed it and where it routed it to so that they can't trace it back to you. And I have the best version of the log deleter because I didn't want to leave any trace whenever I... I mean, that'll really slow down anybody who's trying to find me. There's the Decipher, which I have version 3 of, um, which I believe is the most advanced version of that, which is to crack something that the password cracker can't crack, which is an elliptical code something algorithm. Um, it looks really fancy, and it takes a long time, and it's really annoying. Then I have a proxy disable and a firewall disable to disable two security measures that prevent me from modifying files whenever I have... I mean, I just had to use the proxy disable to modify the criminal record to clear somebody's name. And they only have petty theft charges, so at least I can feel a little bit better about that. Uh, but I did it for money, so... Anyway, um, I've, got a, I've got a mission now, so I'll bring that up. Uh, becoming tired of the competition... No, that's not the one I want. I want... This one, I think. The, oh, man. The man below recently passed away, and we wish to use his identity ourselves. Change his personal status to employed. Um, so I need to go to the International Social Security Database and change Gareth Bolton's status from deceased to employed so that some mysterious... I guess this is uh, OCP.net is my employer here. They're going to use Gareth Bolton as a fake identity. So, in order to do this, I'm going to have to bounce off of a whole bunch of servers. Um, and th this one here with a box around it means that I know the admin password for that. Um, and actually, I think before we do this, since I don't, I'm not comfortable with this kind of thing, I'm going to go into the International Academic Database, which I know I can hack. And I'm going to get the admin password here. Uh, so here I'm going to apply my password breaker. And once I do this, way down in the... Oh, I don't have my tracer running. Um, crap. Uh, where are you? Trace tracker. Okay. So now I've got the password. I think that's all I need. So I can disconnect. Uh, and yep, now I've got one there. Cool. Um, I'm still kind of trying to look for systems that I can get the admin account to relatively easily because that increases the time it takes them to trace you through any system that you use in your network. So um, this uplink test machine has been my fa my best friend because um, it is super easy to break into and r erase my log records from. It was something that they did as a training program and I use it in pretty much all of my connections which might bite me in the ass later but I don't know for sure. And for now, it's been very useful, so I'm still using it. Um, I'm still trying to find weak servers to uh, hack into, so let's give this one a shot. Uh, public access server, cool. Oh, it's just got telephones. That's dumb. So, never mind that one. Test machine. Um, let's see if I can get something from the Protovision public access server. Or is that where I just tried? I think it was somewhere down there that I tried. Protovision, what do we got? Nope, just contact details. So I guess public access servers aren't where, I, where I'm looking for. I'm going to include the Protovision game server. Actually, let's connect to it because this is an easter egg that I tried. Um, if I do here and I type in Joshua, it logs me in. Um, hints gives me some kind of interesting goose chase here. It says, what was the IP of introversion software again? I guess I could look that up because that's the company that made this game. It's some link in a series of easter eggs. But I think now that I have the um, the ad admin password there, nope, it isn't boxed. Shoot. Oh well. Um, I think I'm going to try to include that in my, my relay here. I don't know if the length of the dotted line matters, but um, 
I don't know, sometimes I like to bounce as far away as I can, just to increase the length of the dotted line. In the real world, it kind of would, but it would also introduce more lag and latency between you and your clients that you're actually trying to attack, uh, attack, break into. Uh, let's see, how about this access terminal? Come on, for vision. No public logons permitted. Oh, okay, cool. Um, let's try going... I keep having a slightly different pathway, and I'm going to eventually need to, um... So let's, let's go from the public access server to Protovision's access terminal, which should change and say it's okay. Nope, no public access, never mind. Oh well, I'm still gonna forward through them. Alright. There's gotta be... Okay, public access server, internal services machine. Let's try to break into an internal services machine. I just want to add to my pool of machines that I can use. Here we go, something I can crack. Nice. Uh, so let's get the... Uh, cracker. There we go. The password breaker. Bang. And panel... Nope, I don't even know what that said. But while we're here, let's um, delete some of my logs. So let's go to security, go to log deleter. Oh shit, proxies. I'm already noticed. Eh, uh, whatever. <sighs> Shoot, I wanna, I wanna reconnect that way again, though. Um, and bring my logs, because there are a lot of logs on there from however often I've used that. Okay, so that was the internal services machine, I think. The Sync Associates internal services machine. So let's run it through some uh, little more detailed stuff. I might have to get this one back online afterward, too, but this one's super easy. Um, apparently they've been upgrading it since I've been breaking into it too much, though. Uh, let's go from here to here. Okay, it's somewhat complicated. Um, password breaker. Go real quick. Okay, now I need the uh, firewall, or sorry, the proxy disable. Go. 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 Increase the CPU power to it. I need to get this done. Security. Oh shit, that's way above my security level. Alright, well, this place is too hard to break into, and I'm not going to be able to retain a password. Um, so, I guess, let's try to get down to business and quit trying to screw around with this. Um, international Social Security Database is where I need to go. Um, let's route it through a bank, uh, through the academic database. Um, access terminal, some corporations, uh, sample local area network, the public access server, public access server here, another bank, and let's go through, where is the go government public access server down to international social security. Complicated enough? Probably not. Let's give it a shot. Attempts at legal access will severely punish to the full extent of the law. So I only need read-write access, so which I might do. Um, Gareth Bolton, okay. Uh, oh well, I'm gonna get admin access just cause. Oh good, it's nice and slow. I'm only at 12% on the trace. Tequila? Really? Tequila? Yeah, that's fun. Um, what's this guy's name? Here it is. Gareth Bolton. Um, deceased. Uh, change this to empl employed. Going proxy server, I figured. So let's uh, proxy disable, go, and hope this works. Um, they're already at 62. Uh, this is where it gets really tense because this needs to finish and I'm waiting for this bar to go and there's nothing I can do but wait and make an informed decision on when to uh, disconnect if they get too close to me. 
and I really hope that that proxy server is a um, level one or below because that's all I have. Of seven five. I'm getting really tense. Hurry up! Hurry up! Um, Go. Record updated. Nice. Um, so, do I have time to uh, clear these? Uh, three. Um, okay. Too nervous. But I, I cleaned up some some of the um, some of the logs. So before I report in, I'm gonna go up to my test machine, which is super easy and comfortable to break into. Bam! Always the same password. Uh, and let's get rid of all of these logs. They do trace me here, but even if it does trace me, like this is owned by the company that's employing me, so um, they don't particularly care if they trace me back to my place. Look at all these logs I gotta clean up. Connect. So that was you. Um, I've completed the following mission and created part of a new identity. Cool. Uh, let's see if I've passed. Cool, I've passed. Uh, 5,000 credits. Yay. Wow. It's been a while since I've live streamed, and I really should get some water because holy crap, my throat is going to be destroyed after this. Okay, so this one I'm going to have to clear all of the files on some system. Because uh, I'm greedy. Let's see if I can get that social security password and use that as a one-time login. I doubt I'll be able to. Social security database. Let's go. Yes, yes, I think. Uh, breaker, go. Super fast. Fast click with a bunny. Come on. I really wanted to be knockers one of these times as a shout out to Goldmine. Yay, cool, I got it. Nope, it was revoked. Never mind. Um, let's try to clear all of their company data. This is going to be pretty tense. So I'm going to actually use everything I've got in this endeavor to delete the entire company's data. Super complicated. Normally, this is kind of a bad thing, I think, um, because it leaves logs on all of these computers. But as long as you can break the link, I think, and since I have the, the best like registry cleaner, I can probably get away with this. Um, and it won't leave any trace at all uh, where I've been, or at least. Um, one of the servers will be a dead end. Surprised. Oh, wow. It's a dictionary one. So let's try this again. Okay, what have you got for security? Uh, proxy and firewall. Let's disable those. Uh, proxy disable. Go! Go fast if you can. Uh, so firewall disable. Go. Uh, there are 19 on my trace, which is kind of eh. Six, 30, 34. leader almost ready, but I don't want it to take up clock cycles, so I'm not going to quite prime it yet. This looks like I might have some time to actually go and clean them out. Bam. Bam. Okay, let's go.
wish I had somebody backing me up here. all my accesses. Oh jeez, this is gonna take forever and I'm too paranoid. Oh man. Um. Alright, I guess I should just clean up. Our... Mm. No, I'm gonna break back in. I'm just gonna go back in. Uh, and hopefully this time it will be a lot easier since I don't have to do so I can just go straight into the logs as soon as they did. I really don't know if I should be bouncing off with every single thing here, but... Oh well, live and learn! Uh... Let's see if this has any marked difference in how long it takes them to trace me. I left out a few nodes, so I guess it will be different. Okay, I need to get a new password. Processing power. Man, I wish this HUD was easier for um, Why can't I just batch delete them? In fact, why can't I just like delete their entire database with one click? Like, come on. 84. Oh man, they're already pretty hot on me here. No, no more. Alright, that's as clean as it's gonna get. Just okay. Alright, time to tell them I won. I win. Um, cool, they said I win. Oh, come on, really? Um, dude, I, I deleted everything. What, what do they want? I do. I'm gonna log back in again. I cleaned them all up. In the meantime, I think I'm gonna go here and delete these logs. I guess something that can kind of help is if I delete them from a different connection than I did all of the crap on. Um, all files in their system. In your best interest in removing traces of your actions, the company will not be pleased when they discover what you have done. I did that! What do you want? No, 
Alright, the damage has been done. What, do you need to wait for them to freak out, or what? Okay, I'm gonna look again here, because it says I'm supposed to go to proxy sims, systems, internal services, machine, that IP, delete all files on their system, which I believe I did. Alright, let's, let's do a shorter connection here, and because I just want to look, and I don't need to necessarily disable the firewalls and stuff to look. Um, oh, crackers. I keep looking under security for the password breaker since I suppose it's a secure thing. Mm -hmm. no server. Look, it's all free space. What do you want? Like, come on. Really? Oh, geez, do they want me to go to the internal service? Okay, this is a internal service machine. I don't understand. I did send them a notice of completion, that's what the reply is supposed to be. But when I send a reply, it says, I've completed the following mission, destroy corporate data of a rival company, please credit my account with the remaining payment ASP. And boom, I send it. And immediately bounces back, says we have not heard word yet that the damage has been done. But I did the damage. So what do you want from me? Clean them out. Ah, uh, whatever. I'm gonna look for a different mission. mission. Actually, first I'm going to clean up some other stuff. leave some trace. I don't know what to do about that one. I feel like the silent leaf is connected. Outstanding loan with a bank, international bank, so I'm gonna take care of my loan here. I did, took it out to. I took it out to cover the proxy and firewall blockers. So now I can vote on this page. to go to Landmark International Bank this time. What am I doing? I already have an account with them. So, what is it? It's a well-known financial institute. This individual is subject to an internal destination into corruption. I recently transferred a sizable amount of money to another account. Trace this account. Find the name of the receiver of this money and send a notice of Oh boy. So I need voice. 
voice print identification, which means I'm going to need some voice analytics software in order to do this, I think. <sighs> Lovely. There we go, voice analyzer. Do I need anything for this? Okay. I'm gonna get the best version of that. Cool. So now I've got the voice print analyzer, which I guess is the only thing I needed that I didn't have before. Um, Let's try this again. Here. I guess I don't need to bounce around for this because I just need to go about us uh, and call the administrator. Um, Ian Gordon's voice system. So this should give me a voice sample. Awesome. Um, God, that's so cool. I'm gonna take this, tuck this away for a little bit. Um, I'll need you later. Okay. Actually, I don't wanna. Uh, I guess I can do that because I, I can just clean, clean that up later. Here comes the big one, so I'm gonna go here and get the, the password again. So I'm getting the password for the academic database. Dang it, I keep thinking it's under security. Sun Peaks, I guess. I don't know. Actually, shoot, I didn't need to actually enter. I guess I could have cleaned up my logs when I did that. Oh well. Alright. Let's go from here to here. <laughs> Gonna have to go there anyway, so I might as well. This one yet to go, which I need to decipher for. I don't need you running anymore. Don't hog my cycles. Oh, this isn't gonna be good. 
I'm already at 57. Come on. Oh, that beeping is so tense. Boom. Alright, proceed. Not gonna risk it. Damn it. Oh, this sucks. Okay. So obviously I need a longer chain before I can get there. Uh I was working a hack that's not gonna change their username and password immediately. I need some I need a monitor breaker before I can do that, I think. I don't think I can actually add more admin passwords. I just gotta remember to clean this crap up. One of these damn I'm gonna forget and it's going to kill me. Network. I'm going to leave, lo leave a huge paper trail. Crap, I gotta start this all over. Um, so this should be okay to. Um, are you kidding? I have to get it again? I, I thought I got the version that was supposed to store it. Gross. Gross. Um, maybe it's my memory bank. Come on, really? <sighs> okay, I guess I'll go obtain it again. I mean, it's not on this list. Let's, let's just call this guy at home all of the time. It's annoying. Hello? What a patient uh, system administrator he is. Okay, so now I've got the playback. Um, I'm gonna do that step first, because I think that's gonna be the, the least intrusive step. Lines everywhere. Uh, what hasn't been connected yet? Okay. Whisper notification. Hello. I am the system administrator. My voice is my passport. Verify me. Yay! Oh crap, the trace is already started. Uh, run! Uh, uh, password breaker, go! I don't need the voice analyzer up anymore, so I can just... Spare cycles for that. ability to do this fast enough, I don't think. Because once I get in, I'm going to have to deal with a proxy and a firewall at the same time, again. Uh, here we go. 
Bam. Proceed. Um, geez, don't even have this. Go. This isn't gonna work. They're already at 80. Oh, I'm screwed. Oh, I don't need to change this stuff. I can just... Oh god. Um... Too sensitive. Can't do that. Oh, cool. Um, I got. I still have um, admin access there for some reason. Woo. Okay. Okay. So my chat friend here is telling me that I just have to wait for the news to say that um, they got all of their files destroyed. So I don't know. I can just keep replying to them until it goes through, or can actually check the news. But I'm not going to check the news because. Erg. So I'm just not going to get the money from that for a very long time, it seems like. I don't want to just sit and watch the news board, that's going to be boring as hell. Apparently I've been deleting too many things. Hmm. I'm aware the time speed up will let me do it, but I'm too micromanaging. If they're already tracing me, I may as well. Um, may as well make the most of my time by doing other missions in the, in the meantime. Andrew Gilmore! Okay, rawr. I think I, I did remember him. But this time I've got the admin password. They didn't change it on me for some reason. It doesn't matter whether or not the lines connecting them are stupid, ridiculous long, but if I do have the same pattern every time, it's probably going to be bad. But just this time, I think I'm going to go rather straightforward. Damn it, I have to start over. Oh crap, this means I have to get his voice print again. God damn it. Alright, I'm just gonna get rid of my logs here. routed ones and delete. Oh, and I guess this one too. Roar. Okay, before I do this, I need to call him again, because for some reason it won't store his stupid voice even though I bought the one that's supposed to store it. R. Poor dude. Poor dude who lives in Mexico. Hello? Report my voice. Hello? Hello? So I definitely want to do the voice analyzing thing first, because um, that's what I have ready, and then I can close that program and free up the cycles. Um, no, not you.
I have united the world. Hello, I am the system administrator. My voice is my passport. Verify me. Okay, so as soon as I click here, the time is going to start ticking. So before I do that, let's get my password breaker up. The heck? Why is it beeping at me so much? Faster, I say. Thirty-two. Not bad. Not too bad at all. This is all matrixy. I need all zeros. Cool. So I need. What's this guy's name? Andrew Gilmore? I believe that was his name. Yes, Andrew Gilmore. So, password rule keys. I think that's all I need. Because now I can do a quick and legal bounce here. Stole someone's bank account. Four, okay, here it is. Four, seven, six, five, one, two, one. And your thing is R U L E key. -E key, yes, the letter key. Oh, lame. Okay, I'm gonna look at my keyboard while I'm typing this just in case. Because touch typing, I'm good at it normally, but I want to be absolutely sure. R U L E K E Y S. Go. Awesome. Um. New account. You have a lot in loans, um, but I need transaction history. Here we go. This is the same. Damn, that's a lot of money. Well, I'm not trying to modify it here. Am I? I just... Trace this account and find the name of the receiver of the money. Three, two, five... I'm gonna have to break back in. I'm gonna have to look up um, this account number here. Or maybe... Uh, I just... They're gonna trace me so fast. Let's give this a shot though, just cause. Oh. oh, they're not tracing me. What the heck? Oh, shit. There they go. Go, go, go. As long as it's 25, there's 50. 75? Oh, that is way too... Uh... <sighs> Damn it. Damn it, I don't remember his number anymore. Oh, crap. I should have written it down or something. Or at least typed it somewhere. Um, crap. I still have a rule key, so I, I can get that pretty easy. That That's not going to be difficult to get. Um, I'll just get that again really quick.
So apparently this uh this guy's an uplink member. This is a sus suspicious thing. Oh, he did hit another one, a small one. Okay. Oh, oh, that's just the, uh, it's the account number I need. Okay. Three two five three two three seven. Three two five three two three seven. And look, I put it. Siphon that if I needed to. That's cute. This is the first time I've really broken into a bank big time. Okay, so this has been a heck. I'm gonna need his voice again. God damn it. Um, this one said it would um, save voice samples or something. Maybe if I look at my memory, it will show up. Hello? Hello? Okay, cool, I've got you. Okay, there we go. That's how you do it. Okay, now I can stop calling this guy. Sheesh. Um, okay, so that's ready. Um, Again, I guess. I have to do this. It's crazy. Convolutedness. Get in my network. All you. I probably didn't need to do all this. I might have been able to uh, break through the passport, the password thing for the specific account. Just on its own. Okay. Um, I really wish I could set my thing to automatically use all of processing available. 55 already. I don't like this. I just need to get the name though. This guy. Ian Gordon. Are you freaking kidding? Okay. Boy trolls. Interesting. Boy trolls. So here... Do I- do I need to, like, tell them the name? Or do I just say I, I know the guy's name is Ian Gordon? <sighs> we have reason to believe that person is not responsible. So how do I communicate to them?
I mean, I guess what I can do is I can log in to their account. No, I have it. It's right there. It's, um, three, two, five. Oh, stay there. Three, two, five. Three, two, three, seven. And the code is... Boy... Trolls. Damn it. Normally I can click on it, but I don't have this entered because I didn't crack it, so... Trolls. Damn it! I thought... Okay, how does it... Point... Troll... There's... P-O-I-T-R... Can I pass or crack this? Trells, trells. Okay. Well, I cracked it. Um, oh, pff, I'm not gonna do that. No, that'd be dumb. Um, let's clean up. Like, I should do some maintenance. I should really clean this crap up. I'm just gonna leave them all, and I'll do it right next time. <sighs> okay. I, I keep doing this wrong. Um, I can't believe I, I kept trying trials with an A, not an E. Okay. So I just need to do it this way, and then get in here. Traces, of course. Few statement. Right there. Um, do I need to copy this? Because I just need to prove that this. I need to get his name, I guess. It's the guy I keep calling. It's the administrator of this bank. Um, look at. Oh, wait. Cancel. little tiny things. That's, that's cute. Um, I totally should just like screenshot it or something. Like, come on. To another account. Trace the account for the name of the receiver of the money. So technically, I don't have this person's... I do. Right there. His balance is ridiculous because he just got paid a whole bunch of money, which I guess I could kind of try to siphon from, but I don't think I really want to. Um, especially since this guy owns the freaking bank. Like, he would get very, very angry with me if if that happened. But anyway, um, like, so verify your results. The reason to believe this person's not responsible. I don't even know how I'm indicating who did it. Like, do I need to uh, view statements and, like, file 
happy, like, that thing, and then, like, I'm sure that happened, so first time I'm seeing on my proxy disabled. Like, this is so dumb, but... Oh shit, they're tracing fast. Um. Dude, I can! Dude! What's the guy's name again? Ian... Uh, I'll have him here. Gordon. Bam. Cool. Sorry, Mr. Ian Gordon. I could totally ruin your day. I could totally destroy your, uh... Financial security, um, but I need some kind of ghost account somewhere, and I don't know if I'm comfortable with that. I'll keep that in mind though. If I really need, if I really want to cheese some money, I guess I can transfer some money right now. So I did that way harder than I really needed to, because I could totally have just cracked into one person's password, or one person's account, rather than, like, breaking into the whole freaking bank. Jeez. Okay. I'm gonna try this one and see if, um... Nope, not yet. What happens if, um, the people I was trying to... Destroy, trying to destroy all their records. What if they just keep it on the download? What if they don't report that everything got destroyed? <laughs> Alright, let's take another job. Oh, I did this before. Yeah, we can do that. Great part of a new identity. Break into the International Social Security Database, target computer data, it's the International Social Security Database. Uh, man below recently passed away, we'd like to use the identity ourselves. Alright, let's try to do this. Andrew Gilmore? I swear to god, I just did this. Did he get killed again? This is the same guy. I think this is the same guy. I think he keeps dying. Like, there's gonna be, like, some kind of scandal launched about the immortal man or something, how, like, I don't know. I mean, it's kind of quiet, but someone working there must be thinking the same thing of, like, didn't I just change this guy's status to deceased already? Anyway, let's go to the social security database again. Nice and 
And those are the only ones I have direct access to without, like, really trying to break in. Okay, now that I have that ice in my let's go. I'm always connecting along this line. Like, I constantly go to the Uplink Public Access server and then go to the Academic Database. Oh, dude, the bank is gone. Why is the bank gone? I was using- I had an account there. Yeah, whatever. Dude, I can go through Ian Gordon's voice system? Like, really? Like... Um... I have a feeling that that would be ridiculously hard to track. Like... Can I do that? Does that- have I been doing it before? Like... Oh my god, that's so tempting. Oh, someone's reminding me that this is the guy... Oh, this is the guy who did the... Um... Who was at the bank that I was looking up. Um... Okay, social security system. So my plan- I might be playing two sides of a war here. Like, I, I created an identity for- well, okay. I guess now I'm- Maybe he got killed. But- but that was- that was just a corruption scandal. That wasn't- uh, I'll have to see. Probably watch my own video again. Uh, Alright, so this one shouldn't be too bad, if I remember. For some reason, social security is easy to break into. So here I'm looking for, what's your name? Andrew Gilmore. Um, Andrew, Andrew Gilmore. Yeah. Here we are. No, this is a totally different dude from the, the other guy I fixed up. quickly because I'm already at 63. Mm. Apparently I made a big mistake by um, contacting Ian Gordon directly and I should have tried to go through a server that I could modify. Well that's a log I can't clean up. Cool, commit. Record updated. Nice. Uh, do I have time for this? Uh... Oh shit, that's what I, I didn't want. I wanted to keep that one. No more routes. Oh god, I really need to get out of here. Alright. Most of my stuff. Nice. Hmm. So I got that done. Money! City Link Microsystems. Interesting. One more time, let's give this a shot. I could- I, I don't want to check the news. Maybe I have to see it. Maybe I have to see that it's in the news. <sighs> Alright, let's go. Let's just check it. It's not going to take that long to go to the new server. Academic database hacked again. Less than a week, and it was the third this month. Oh, this one came longer. Yeah, perhaps all this is a service. But I'm doing messy. Good thing I'm not actually modifying those very much. Um, so it looks like no, it hasn't been reported yet. Lame. <laughs> what if I um, hack the uplink server to make a fake news report <laughs> that they're going to make anyway? Yes, this stupid company like lost all their data, right? Like totally. 
and you should totally pay the person that you, uh, come on, the people who hired them, get on the ball. That's what the, that's what the news report says. And <laughs> I don't get implicated at all. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. I'm interested in financial data on an enemy. So I've done something like this before, so I guess I can contact and take a look at this. How secure? Proxy servers or firewalls? Well, I've done with those before. Why so much money? The data is highly personal and well protected. I want all the money now. Um, I guess I could, I could bargain with them, but I'm afraid I can't offer you any more money. All right, whatever. I took it anyway. I don't know what that says about me totally caving here, but. Open his account and determine the size of his loan. Send this information to us. Action Labs International Bank. Okay, so this should be pretty easy. Um, I'm not even sure I'll have to bounce off of all that much to... Uh, to be happy with this. So where's my target? Here, Action Labs. I'm just gonna go through the ones that I know. So, what am I doing here? I need... Okay. I have his account number, so that's cool. Um, uh, oh, damn it. Like, it won't stay highlighted. Um, 5, 3, 4, 4, 7, 8, 9. Size of his loan, six hundred. That was that was stupid. That was stupidly easy. Like, come on, really? Six hundred. Thank you for working for. That was it. That was too much money for that. That's ridiculous. Like. They just wanted me to peek it. There was no fire... whatever. Like, come on. Really? Ah, <sighs> uh, whatever. That was... Uh, that was so much less painful than the last time I broke into a bank. Okay. Give me a new... Give me a new mission. Alright, I gotta... I gotta advance time because I don't really want to take these missions yet. Or if I ever do want to take those missions. Or I can peek at software upgrades. Oh, I really want this thing. Um, yeah, I really want that thing. Yes, academic database has been hacked yet again. Mwahaha. Reassures community. Okay, so there's this overall plot that's sort of been developing as I've been playing, where this mysterious group that it's their company's called Arc, but it translates to something I don't even remember. Anyway, they've been hiring a whole bunch of uplink agents, like the top ones, to do things for reasons that they won't disclose. And apparently, someone spoke out against them for being too secret. And Arc's all, well, we're gonna have a press release shortly. And now we've got another one here. It says, um, the a surprising development in the mystery of Andromeda Research Corporation, that's what ARC is. The number one rated uplink agent has come forward and tried to reassure the community. This comes two days after Agent Xenomorph publicly expressed concern that ARC were hiring agents to work on some kind of weapon. That was not what it said before. Anyway, the agent, known amongst the hack community as Matt Black, says in his statement that I have been working for ARC in a confidential project for the past two weeks. The project is immensely ambitious in nature, but nothing to worry about. ARC have been keeping the public in the dark to protect their trade secrets. Public agents should not be afraid of accepting jobs from this company. 
Some people have said they think ARC are building some kind of military weapon. I can say that I have had full access to the ARC central mainframe for the past week and there is nothing of that sort on the system. What they are doing is being kept under wraps, but it is definitely not a weapon. Agent at Black is a well-respected hacker with years of experience and his uh, comments will certainly reassure the community. If you believe him... Oh, there's probably some intrigue going on there. Um, and Matt Black could be the person behind all of it in the first place. At least that's what I suspect, because I'm always distrustful of them saying there's nothing to worry about. Okay, well, um, that's not what I was looking for, so I gotta wait for time to go on. Ooh. Okay. I can do this trivial one real quick. Nice. Bring a neural computer system and sabotage files. Nice. Super easy. That was one of the most basic things. I started doing that when I was starting out. Oh dear. Oh my god. It's just flooded with Landmark Computers International Bank being hacked. Oh my god. No. <laughs> That's all my fault. All of it. Oh my god. Oh crap, this is all my fault. Holy shit, they're all me. Okay, let's go back to when it wasn't me and we'll see how much damage it is. Um, so the government academic database is hacked again, yeah. Make sure it's me. Global criminal record database attacked by hackers. This is probably me. Unknown computer hackers. The security system is so tight that hacks of this kind were thought to be impossible. Hee <laughs> hee! Um, this occurred on April 1st, yes. Here's from preliminary investigation that an unknown criminal record was modified, prompting calls from human rights groups for higher security on personal records of this kind. Everyone said they've begun an investigation and have taken steps to stop this from happening again. Yeah. Um, not good. Uh, records open to the public domain. Despite the installation of brand new high security system, local criminal defenses can be attacked or penetrated by a hacker or a group of hackers. The same to me is that their new system had failed so soon. This one's not me, I don't think. Um, because I've... Hackers masquerading as officers. Okay, so this one isn't me. Um, really saw this a little bit and tested in light of this new breach. Take advantage of criminal... global criminal database. It's recently suffered a couple of high security hacks, and we've seen more and more hackers are taking advantage of the system. Their time less than a month after the Ministry of Access System and all the criminal records within the system. So, did I open the floodgates? Because I definitely hacked it first. Just, oh my gosh. And that's why they were paying me so much money to just to remove somebody's petty theft thing, is because they wanted to follow my trail or something and maybe have me compromise it for the first time. Or, oh, they could have a, um,. They could have had an in on developing the new security system that my breach caused and that let a bunch of people come in behind me because the new security system was already compromised when it got installed. Interesting. Anyway, a group of individuals offering modification to personal records to criminal records for a price. Perhaps a direct as into underground anarchi anarchist group Uplink Corporation. Clamps down on accesses to the system, claiming it is safer than ever. And it's modified again. Successfully attacked once again. Security at the server system has been compromised numerous times in the past month. Hackers could clear existing records or have innocent people thrown in jail. Government is now considering shutting down the global criminal database until this can be resolved. Yike. Smashed open again! More security holes than popular micro software written in the late 20th century. Uh, hackers could clear- yes. Government appears to be unable to put a stop to these attacks. Wow. This new service has unfortunately lost count of the number of hacks at this site in recent times. Uh, yes, I know. Unable to put a stop to these attacks. Source code deleted by hacker. This one might be me. A proxy system found in cells in the public eye today is one of the primary computers is some complete failure, resulting in a large amount of data lost data. Dominate the market once released. This might be me. Wait. Who do you want me to do this, Anne? The, this was against proxy systems. Okay, cool. Good. That was me. Oh my god. I finally got the payment for that stupid mission for so freaking long ago. Um, 
Nice. And... On your through recent successes, we've been following your career with interest. As an up-and-coming agent, you will find a number of new opportunities are now available to you. At this point, we feel we should give you an important piece of information. Now that the stakes are higher, you will certainly begin to encounter computer systems that are more secure than before. These systems can be difficult to attack. Most of our agents now use the HUD Connection Analyzer to get around these systems. This item of software was designed by Uplink Corporation specifically for bypassing security systems and can be purchased from the Uplink Internal Services. It is designed to be used in conjunction with security bypassers, also available from that site. Uplink Corporation wishes you luck. Um, fill the sin. You have re reached the next Uplink rating. I am now skilled. Cool. <laughs> I love my name. Fill the sin. Um, sleep by hacker. Cause that was me. The Action Labs International Bank. Is that what I was targeting for so long? Penetrate for own source. This is the first this incident for Action Labs. And a number of fund transfers. Government social security records compromised, I think, is me. I, I shouldn't be gloating over these things, but like. I don't know, it's kind of cool to see news articles about my my stuff. Like, if you ever played Hitman Blood Money at the end of every mission, they give you a news account of the mission you just did. And that's always so tasty, especially when they, um, like, chalk it up to accident. Like, oh, I just fell down the stairs, or there was a mishap with a misplaced prop or something. And it's, oh my gosh, it's so good. But in this case, even seeing any news whatsoever about it is kind of disturbing, because if I did my job right, it should be completely silent, and they shouldn't even notice anything is wrong. Uh, the moon is. This is the first and only incident of its kind. <laughs> in theory, unlawful changes to this database could result in dead people being reported as alive, or alive people being reported as dead! Other personal information could be stolen. I stated that this would not be allowed to happen again. Well, I've got news for you, buddy. I've already done it twice. Hacked twice in less than a month. Yeah. Once again, been hacked by an unknown cyber criminal. This is the second time in less than a month that the system has been hacked. It is not known if these two incidents are connected. Yes, I'm aware. Crucial personal data. All files compromised for the third time. Uh, it's a social security database. <laughs> the system holds some key personnel data on millions of people and has been the cause of some embarrassment recently for the government. Repeated security failures. This have again penetrated the international economic database. Repeatedly in the last month. Okay, so landmark. Unauthorized money transfers were performed, so that that was not me, because I didn't transfer anything yet. That's their online payment system. Attack for the third time. Okay, so. That's something else going on. Uh, system is attacked four times last month. Performed some kind of financial transfer that attempted to remove any traces of their actions. This, this is actually a nice unwinding after all those really tense hacks that I was doing. Oh man, I'm really tempted to try to steal that ridiculous number amount of money from uh, Ian. Poor Ian. Hired freelance computer specialists in an attempt to catch the guilty parties. I would love to be hired to catch myself and then uh, incriminate somebody else instead of me. Oh, that'd be great. Uh, so considering further action in light of this number of recent hacks. Okay, so I'm gonna stay away from Landmark because Landmark is probably super tight right now. Hired computers. Freelance computer specialist, yes, I know. Boy, they just keep getting <laughs> penetrated. Confident they will catch the hacker. Oh, great. Well, I definitely had a bunch of repeated attempts on them, so that's kind of scary. Scientific research. I don't want to destroy scientific research unless this is against ARC. Experienced. I'm only skilled, I'm not experienced. Welcome to the death of reality. 
Um, high security system and stuff. I almost want to chill out for a bit and maybe just do some stuff on my own. Maybe like, I'm gonna I'm gonna clean up some stuff because stuff needs to be cleaned up, like big time. And I'm already on a mission anyway, so. Um, what am I supposed to do on this mission that I have? Oh, all oh right. This is a super easy one. Okay, cool. So I'll just use stuff I trust. I got your thing done. <laughs> I like how they freak out. It's cute. <sighs> okay. Wow. I've been streaming for forever. Alright, that's cool. I'm gonna stop now. Anyway, thanks for watching. Take care.